What's up guys, this is Sean Heather and in this video I'm going to show you how to update your Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra to Android 13 and One UI 5 manually and you can use the same method on other Samsung Galaxy smartphones as well. So here we go. So as you can see here my Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra is running on Android 12 and One UI 4.1. So I'm going to update it to One UI 5 and Android 13 right here in front of you because if I go to the software update section, you can see One UI 5 or Android 13 update is not available on my device still now. So I will use the manual method for that. And to install the One UI 5 Android 13 update on our Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra, we will use the Odin and Bifrost. I have shared the download link of all of these software and apps in the description of this video. You can use the Bifrost on Windows, Linux as well as on Android. The user interface is exactly same on Windows or on Android. So you can use any of these platform to download the Android 13 software package of your Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra. I'm going to use the Bifrost Android application. So once you got Bifrost either on your Android smartphone or Windows or Linux powered device, then just launch it. After that, you need to enter the model number and the region of the firmware. To find it, you can go to the settings. After that, go to the about phone section and then go to the software information. And here you will find under the service provider software version, the model number of your device that starts with SM dash. So here you can see for my Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra, it's SM S908 B and right below it you will find the region that is EUX. KSA is the location where I'm using the device but the firmware is of a European device. So for my device the region will be EUX. Once you find this information just go to the app and type the model number region and after that tap on the refresh logo and then it will start looking for the latest software update available for your device. So here you can see the Android 13 with One UI 5 is available for my Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra. So now all you need to do is just tap on this download arrow button and the downloading of the software will be started. But before that you will have to select the folder where you would like Bifrost to save the downloaded package. Since this method downloads the whole ROM and software of your device, it will be huge in size here. It is around 7.9 GB, so it will take a bit of time. Now when the software is downloaded fully, the decryption of the software package is started and you will get a zip file in an unencrypted format that you can use with Odin. Once the decrypting of the file is completed, you can copy the file from your smartphone if you are using this method or if you have already downloaded on your computer, then you are good to go now. In the next stage, you need to run the Odin as administrator on your device. Now in the next stage, you need to switch on your Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra in the download mode. For that, first of all, you need to switch off the device. Once it is switched off, you need to press the volume up and volume down together and connect the device with your computer using a USB type C cable. So here I'm pressing the volume up and down together. Keep pressing and holding together and then connect it with your PC using the USB type C cable. You can see now the device is showing this warning message. All you have to do is press the volume up one more time to continue the process. And now we are inside the download mode. You can see it is showing downloading. And here you can see that the device is added now. Now let's go back to the place where you have moved the downloaded software package. So now you need to just extract it. Once the zip file is extracted, you can see that you will find five files here. Out of it, you have to use four files. You can see we got two CSC file, the CSC and home CSC. You will have to use the home CSC with Odin because if you use the CSC then it will wipe all of the data on your device and you will start fresh with Android 13 and One UI 5 on your Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra. But if you want to keep all of your data you will have to use the home CSC. So now you just need to go to the Odin and browse and select all of these four different files from where you have saved them. So for BL select BL. You can see it is added. Do the same for rest of them as well. While selecting CSC, do not forget to select home CSC if you want to keep your data. This is 
very important and now just click on a start button here and you can see that the process of updating the software is started here on our Odin. So the process is fully completed now and now my Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra is restarting. So I can now disconnect my device from my laptop. And here you can see that One UI version is upgraded to 5 and the Google Play system update is of 1st September as well. So now the latest Android 13 and One UI is updated on my Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra. I will make a separate video where I will talk about all of the new features and differences that you are going to get after installing One UI 5 and Android 13 update on your Samsung Galaxy S22 Ultra or whatever Samsung Galaxy smartphone you got. So do not forget to hit the subscribe button and press the bell icon to get the notification when that video is live. And I'll see you guys next time in another video. Have a nice day.